Hello guys, it's me Khushal Khan and today in this video I'm gonna tell you how to create a trust in Access VM. So this is very simple, easy, just you have to follow the steps and remember a few things. So this is I have created before uh, this trust. I just want to show you how it look like how what thing we're gonna create in this video. So we will create this trust. So just open your Access VM and or create a new file, select front view, Hungarian and Hungarian and OK and then go to geometry select line okay and uh, specify your point okay the like your diameters or the length of the truss okay and uh, it should be 4 okay then 2 meter again and then 2 and then oh sorry okay now you have just follow me uh, is it okay yeah that's okay and then you have to specify everything oh no not there it's not perfect yeah like this okay and like this yeah that's all now what we have to do we have to convert this system into the trust what how you have just click here anywhere okay uh, oops why is not working one minute okay uh -huh. oops no 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 not this i don't want this why it's not working i don't know why but select all click okay uh -huh. oh i don't know just wait a minute my i think the click is not working or something why 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 Oh, oops. Um, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I don't know why. So, maybe no, not now. This, yeah, this is working now. It's working, but before it wasn't working. I don't know why. What was the mistake? What was the issue? Okay, it's, yeah, it's working. Uh, yeah that's all so you click on this select everything then just simple um, pick a, any where any uh, member so what we have to do first we created this now we want to convert this everything into the trust so we have to define that this is a trust so just select um, uh, here's trust because we will, we will convert this every this structure into the trust okay select trust here um, select material because we, we have to define the material as well that from which it is made so steel and I will select this as 235 click OK now the cross section OK we have to define it because in the beam we define I beam or the horizontal beam so in this case uh, it's a truss so it's not a beam so we will make it as a pipe so select we will select the cross section as a pipe like it will be a circular OK click on this um, uh, cross section library so thin and here you can see this all click on this this is like a pi four pipes and here you can select the hungarian pipe and then you can select the diameter i will select this here you can see the preview this is the cross section in circular uh, form this is a pipe uh, cross section and every parameter is shown here you can check this all if you want then click ok and then click ok now it is defined now after this we will uh, uh, specify uh, specify the supports okay select the corners where you want to put supports here and now I want uh, okay now we have uh, I will make one end as a hinge and the other as a roller so it is hinge it is hinge as well so but I will convert it into the roller so I will make this x axis as zero because the roller has only vertical support now this is perfect um, supports okay like it's perfect okay yeah that's and now just go to the freedom degree select all and define your the coordinates for your truss okay override it okay then click ok now uh, i will specify here the load and and here the horizontal okay because we have one horizontal uh, what we have one horizontal uh, reaction so i will specify here the horizontal to cancel this okay to make it balance go to the nodal load and click here and okay and horizontal axis 4 kN okay that's all you can see here I will also activate here the units that you will be able to show in which unit oh what's 
what's going on i don't know what's happening with my computer yeah leave it and now again they know the support here okay so click here okay and then put here the values for your load it's minus 12 i want and then click okay now you can see here i have just uh, uh like uh, specify my loads and you can see the unit as well so everything is ready go to the static so this is how you can create the trust and put the supports and define the loads create the zero uh, fourth members and you can do a lot there are many options you can do and then click on the linear analysis so it's perfect and you can see everything now the horizontal displacement and everything you can go to diagram so this is how you can create your trust system and also you can create here the like a uh, report system okay so if you click here on this uh, you will take the picture of your trust okay uh, this is the you know you can specify here the like uh, name and everything like this this is for the screenshot of your trust system and this is for uh, drawing library this is your library where you have like uh, created everything you know the photos that you have taken it will be like you can see this um history okay and here you can make the this is the report report maker if you want to make report for your whole project so you can make the reports i will just i will just show it to you you, you can see here you can import anything to your uh, report from here from the gallery or from the drawing library so like because so like i want to import the, this image here select your image click this up so it will be inserted here like this you can uh, bring your report here okay and many other things you can do here okay you will learn with the passage of time this is the table browser you can click here and then okay and you can see this okay like uh, if you have a huge project so there will be much many things that you know now i have one material that is steel so you if you when it's a big project there will be different materials so then you can sorry then you can just um, import your uh, this uh, data from here to your report okay like you have you can select material and then click on this it will be added to your report and like cross we have one cross section pipe you can import it here as well and we have add nodal so you can Im import it load cases we have one load cases that is okay static load we have you can import this as well and many other things which you want to add into your report you can uh, just insert into the, your report okay now i'll just go to my report and here you can see everything that i have uh, added to my report it is uh, you can see everything okay now you can just export it to click on this you can export it okay i just want to show saving to my desktop okay click okay now it has been saved so this was our trust and we created the report for this trust as well so this is the model like you know uh, report i created i will just open it for you so i will show you how it looks like okay this this is the extra folder for the my reports you know we took the pictures so okay analysis by khushal khan wow i really like my name when it appears somewhere haha <laughs> that was okay you can see here this is the image i created okay we took the picture so this is the image and everything we added to our trust system you can see the material and this is the you can you can see here this color and texture you can see the units for that and you can the cross section details nodes and everything okay so this is how you can do uh, uh, design the structure and make the report from the report for it so in this video this uh, that was uh, that was all okay so see you in the next video uh, till then bye bye and subscribe my channel and if you have any question you can ask in the comment and i will reply surely okay bye bye have a nice day